Today, I'd like to take you behind the scenes to WNO's production of Mozart's Magic Flute. The Magic Flute follows the adventures of a handsome young prince named Tamino and his birdcatcher sidekick, Papageno. The costumes and scenery were designed by award-winning children's author and illustrator, Maurice Sendak. The handsome prince, Tamino, wears a light blue silk satin 18th century coat. The vest is an iridescent brocade that picks up many of the colors in the scenery. This is the costume for Papageno, the bird catcher. When we first meet him, has a wonderful bird disguise headdress, and you can really see the whimsy of Maurice Sendak's creativity in. It's just meant to sit on top like this, and he wears it for a few moments when we meet him, and then he removes it so we can see that he's just a guy under that bird disguise. The dragon looks very much like many of the characters in Sendak's illustrations, menacing but somehow still friendly. It's a big head, but it's actually made very lightweight and the entire costume can be worn and operated by one person. The Queen of the Night wears a very imposing headdress that leaves no question that she is the head of her domain. Her costume, still in the 18th century style, made of dark sky blue velvet, appliqued with stars and Swarovski crystals. I hope you've enjoyed this peek backstage at the wonderful Maurice Sendak costumes for the Magic Flute. Enjoy the show.